Okay, UK Europe has 20, uh, sorry, 29 IPCs to spend. They're going to spend 27. And they're going to be purchasing um, uh, a tank for their South African factory, a, um, a um, transport and a destroyer for their Canadian factory, and for the uh, home islands, two infantry and one more fighter plane. Uh, they only have one attack to make this round, and it's a naval attack. They will be attacking the Italian uh, cruiser and um, uh, transport ship in Sea Zone 94 with the fighter and tactical bomber from Gibraltar. Oh, and while we're in the area, uh, these guys are in port, so they will be repaired. Okay, there's a port on Gibraltar. So these two ships are repaired. And so we will set up the only attack of the round. All right, season 94, the uh, Italian cruiser Trento and the transport Neptunia are being attacked by a fighter and a tactical bomber. And they hit the cruiser. Cruiser fires back and hits, so we will lose the fighter, okay? And the um, transport is auto-killed. Okay, let's do the non-combat moves for the British. The South African tank is going to go two spaces up to the Belgian Congo. The two South African infantry are going to move into Tanganyika territory. Um... Up here on the Horn of Africa, the uh, infantry and artillery in Ethiopia are going to get onto the transport, move to C-Zone 81, and offload into Cairo. The uh, tank from Ethiopia will drive into Cairo. Uh, and then what we have up here is we're going to take this transport, we're going to move it to Malta, pick up the infantry and the um, anti-aircraft, go to C-Zone 98, and offload in Cairo to... Uh, to try and get them some defense. Uh, the remaining tactical bomber in the C-Zone 94 attack uh, will land in C-Zone 91, and the battleship and the carrier will also go there uh, as well. Oh, uh, sorry, I didn't mark this, but one of the fighters from um, London will also fly down and join the um, the carrier okay for some additional defense okay um, all right other movement um, oh up in London uh, well up in Ireland the uh, mechanized infantry is going to scoot around through Scotland and back into the UK uh, I think that's all the movement oh sorry no there's not one more uh, the South African um, destroyer is going to come forward up to season 91 to support that uh, budding uh, naval fleet that's happening there because the Germans were not able to destroy it all last turn. So that's all the movement. I'll tidy up the board. We'll come back with placement and uh, money. I think I forgot to mention, but the um, British bomber in Quebec is going to fly home. Okay, that was the last move that I, uh, I marked it, but I didn't mention it. Okay, for placement of new units, the two new infantry are going to go into the UK. The new fighter is going to go into the UK. Uh, the two Canadian ships are going to go into Sea Zone 106 off the coast of New Brunswick and Nova Scotia. And of course, the South African tank is going to go down in South Africa. All right, uh, in terms of income, nothing has changed. Um, the British are at uh, 29 IPCs. Um, so they will get that. They saved two IPCs, plus they get a five IPC bonus for having all of their uh, non-African original territories. So uh, 29, 31, 30 six IPCs to start the next turn. So the 
Italians are going to be up next. So let's see what Italy does with a rather free hand in the med. Uh, so we'll see.